all of us can relate to receiving those bothersome robocalls. Although there are regulations in the works to outlaw certain types of automated dialing, no one, and I mean no one, can escape the sound of the cell. Your call is very important to us. I all love this. They're calling me. They're not supposed to have my number, and now they're putting me on hold. No matter where I am, no matter what I'm doing, it happens multiple times a day. A solicitor calling my cell phone. Hey, thank you for holding. This is Darren with National Dealer Service calling about the manufacturer's warranty on your vehicle that may be expired. Okay, how uh, did... It looks like here it is expired. How did you get my phone number? They got it by using computers that dial billions of numbers hoping someone will pick up. While many callers are legit, albeit questionable marketers, the motives of other callers are much more malicious. So they're just trying to use the notion of getting a warranty as a way to get a payment method from you or steal your identity. Alex Qualisi's company, Umail, created a free app for your mobile phone that prevents robocalls from ever reaching your ringer. It's designed to not let the bad guys ring through, and if they do and they leave a voicemail somehow, we put that in a spam folder so you're not bothered with it. But if they do get you on the phone, sometimes even the most savviest consumers aren't able to cut them off. So I get this call generally once or twice a day, and there's an option on the menu that you can be removed from the call list, and I've never been removed from the call list. And you probably haven't either. That's because there are two sets of robocallers, those based in the U.S. and those overseas. The Federal Trade Commission has prosecuted domestic robocallers and fined them hundreds of thousands of dollars. And recent anti-robocall legislation called TRACED is giving more enforcement ability to governing agencies. It's mandating that the carriers roll something out to minimize spoof calls getting through. So it's very early, and I don't think we've seen much impact from the Trace Act yet, but that's the main thing now to try to reduce the robocalls. Regardless, you can still have a little fun with them. I'm going to go ahead and transfer you now, sir. All the questions you have, they're going to answer them, give you the details about the extended warranty on your vehicle. Just hold the line, Mr. Springsteen, one moment. I was born to run. I will. I got to admit, that was fun.